I cannot believe it is here. It is something we wait for every year. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. friends it is 4 a.m it is thursday morning and it is the first day of vlogmas i am super excited to go through the season with each of you and have fun together and make memories i've been chatting with some of you over on instagram about how this has become one of your traditions and equally so it has become one of mine and before we even get started i just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for inviting me into your life into your homes and allowing me to be a part of it it is a little after 4 a.m um, that's my typical wake up time and we are just going to get the day started as i would any day and let the day take us where we go but before I do that, there is a piece of holiday decor that I did. It's not quite done yet, but I have to share it with you. This year's theme was vintage glam. So lots of sparkle, lots of glitz, lots of color, and it was so much fun. But I thought my banisters needed that same glitz and glam, so I created this. It doesn't even have lights on it. It just looks like it is lit. Can, I mean, can we just take in this holiday goodness? And then it goes up the staircase. You're probably wondering how I did it. So let me show you. Roll the footage. I had an order to pick up at Michael's. These garlands were $3.99 a piece. I think I bought six of them. These are beautiful, and I got them for 10 bucks. I mean, you cannot beat them. They are normally $30, and I paid $10 for them. Like, amazing deal. So, what I'm doing right now is one of them is far too thin, so... I have two spiraled together of the $3 garlands. You can already see how much fuller it looks. They just need a, I know, Bubby, they need a lot of love. They just need a ton of love. Are you saying hi to everyone? But I'm going to finish getting two of these all put together to show you how full they can be. What I need you to know is that I know this looks terrible. But I'm telling you, when I'm done, it will look amazing. So, I like, like the alternate drape, and now what we have to start working with is getting these bad boys nestled in. And I'm telling you, when I'm done, you're gonna be impressed. I'm gonna go through like, very closely with wire and wire all of this in. I have started the bottom and you can already see how it's taking shape. What's great about this is I was going to cut wire but I actually don't have to because these branches are all wired. So I'm just like nestling it into the branches so I don't have to worry about wires hanging anywhere. What I'm doing is really just trying to like open the branches on either side and then I'm sticking this in to that nook that I make as close as possible and then making those couple branches super, super tight. And then as I go, pulling some of the branches back through, you can move the, each ornament is wired so you can really like manipulate them how you want them to go, which is also really nice. So just twisting, nestling. The key though is to get those branches really, really tight. I'm 
No picks or ribbons yet. I did end up using about four of those ball garlands, but look at this. There are no picks, like I said, no ribbons, but that's what we have so far. It's so dramatic and it's so full. It's kind of unbelievable to see. So easy peasy and I would say total spent was about $50 for this whole thing. So hope this was helpful. Now back to vlog. If you are new to Vlogmas, we have a couple things to share with you. First, we have two advent calendars. This year we have a self-care advent calendar, something I need to prioritize, as well as a random acts of kindness calendar. We also have Vlogmas merch. We also have our traditional Spotify playlist. All of those things will be linked every single day in the video, as well as products that I use and things that I think you will like. We will definitely add those. I'm gonna do some gift guides through Vlogmas early on so you can do some planning. And yeah, so always check that description box. There might be some things that I link that you want to know about and it'll be down there. And if I don't, just always ask and I can share where I got it. Today's two advent calendar activities on the self-care and the kindness is one to reflect about what I want to get out of this season and also to start a new book. I came across this when it released this year and it's called A Merry Little Meat Cute and I am super excited to dive into it. So that's how we're going to start our morning. We're going to do a little self-care and read our book. I'm going to also do one of my advent calendars as I wait. I got this 20 minute candle because 20 minutes to unplug and think and renew is sometimes quite enough. It has like the cutest little disc that you set your candle down on. There we go. It came with matches, but I'm going to go ahead and get my little lighter. This thing is amazing. And I am going to make my new favorite thing. Sometimes I don't always have the desire to drink coffee, but I can tell you, I always have the desire for this clever chai super latte. So good. Just add water. It's oat based. Um, it's so good. It has a probiotic in it. So I'm going to make a cup of chai and then we're going to read. You can also get their latte dust, which is chef's kiss amazing. Really does finish the latte beautifully. I'm just using my Smeg. This is a milk frother. It does hot chocolate. It does all the things. I really, really love it. So, and I also love the festive red. Can you even handle how beautiful this is? I apologize for it being a little dark, but I really want to just enjoy the dining room. And I'm going to light my little 20 minute candle. How cute is that? So that will be my timer. I'm going to enjoy my chai. I'm gonna read my book. And that is how we will start our day. And I'm going to end with some quiet, just time to myself to pause, reflect, and think about this holiday season. And a little bit about what I wanna get out of it. We did our 20 minute candle. All that's left is the little wick. It was 
actually almost exactly 20 minutes so I really love these just to like have that keep your time instead of looking at your phone or setting an alarm it allows you to stay focused and all that was left is this little piece of wick throw that away put that back in the box and we'll be good to go we will do all of the advent calendars when I come home. All right, riveting content. I have a load of laundry that's about to be done. I'm gonna fold that. I'm gonna start getting ready for work and all the things. Ugh, I'm a little stuffy this morning. I feel like everyone's stuffy though. Look at that. That is just like Christmas joy. All right, friends, I'm going to head off to work and I will catch up with you in a little we bit. We are home from work. And we have two doodles. This one's not feeling super great, but this one is so big. So big. Look at her. She also just got a haircut, so she is looking sharp. Some packages came. This is actually part of Steven's Christmas gift. I am going to be sharing all the things that I got Steven for Christmas, and I'm just going to wait till I get more to share some ideas with you, but I have really good ideas for him. And then I have some travel coming up, so I just grabbed some travel pants and like a light jacket, but what I wanna share with you, they came today. This brand has been on my Instagram and I finally bought a pair. So it's a company called Clove and they make really cool sneakers that I just thought were like so clean and simple yet fun. There's like that cool gold on the back. I just think they're really, they just like look super chic. So I picked those up. I'll let you know, but I'll link them below. They feel really nice. Like the quality is really great. So, a little bit of happy mail today. Actually, I just walked in complete circles. Why not jump into some advent calendars? That will be fun. I also wanna see what this one is. So, this is an adventure advent calendar. I guess I can take it out of the box now. Disconnect to reconnect. The purpose here is to unplug from the busyness of the holiday season, connect and have fun. No take backs. If you scratch off a challenge, you have to do it. If you don't feel like it, too bad, do it anyway. Discover something new about yourself. Take a picture, if everyone feels comfortable, and write about your adventure on the back of the page. We are here to help you create lasting memories. Upload your photos. Okay, great. Oh, so you stick your photo here and you scratch off the adventure. Oh, this does not start until December 14th. How many days is it? I guess it's not. Oh, it's 12 days. So we're not gonna jump into this one yet. Let's go ahead, I'm excited to do this one. This is the George and Vin 24 Days of Beauty. There are going to be some beauty products in here that I'm just going to share with friends, but there's a ton of skincare as well. So, this first one is a Butter London Patent Shine Nail Lacquer. I'm going to get my nails done on Saturday. I'm really excited, but I will most likely give that to Stephanie when I go. This calendar is quite elaborate. But here is day one. Oh. The packaging on this is stellar. And it is our favorite, Faux de Bois. It is a fire, all things amazing. What I'm going to do with this when it's all done is I'm actually going to use it to store planner stuff. That's what I do with a lot of my calendars. But this one would be so nice if you take the boxes out and make it like into a desk organizer because it glows in the dark. It's super cool. So that is what we'll do with this one. We always have to have a figurine train. So this is ultimately what it will look like when we're done. But day one.
is, is it just two? It is two of our tracks. All right, our track has started. I love the gold foiling on it. Our next one is Saks Fifth Avenue. There will be some beauty products in this one, but mostly skincare. So I love Aromatherapy Associates. This is a deep relax sleep mist. So it is a sleep mist. It is lavender based, deep relaxation. Super excited about that. All right. One, two, three, done. And we have come to Sugarfina, and you guys know the tradition. Pour some sugar on me in the name of love. Day one. These are cuter boxes than last year. All right. Day one, did you hear something? Did you hear something? What do you think? And those are dark chocolate sea salt caramels. I'll have that with a glass of wine this evening. All my goodies are right here. That's all taken care of. Oh, I know what we have to do. In the pantry. This was sent by an amazing, sweet, loving subscriber and friend. She said to give Dolly another shot. Hello, Dolly be better than last year. Dolly, well, it couldn't get much worse than last year. So at least it's not an empty box. It has a piece of chocolate. A chocolate star. Also, she has a Christmas movie on tonight I will be watching. I already have it set to record. But we are giving the icon, the amazing Dolly, another shot this year. Don't let us down, Dolly. Don't let us down. You better have been working nine to five for this one. All right, so that is that. When Steven is here, we will do our David's tea, doggies will get theirs. I don't know how you're feeling, so maybe you can't have yours tonight, but we'll see. All my candles are coming on. It's around five o'clock, but this is like my favorite time of the day. So like all my lights are coming on. I did do my snowflakes again this year. If you remember these, I did these a few Vlogmases ago. I once did them in the dining room window but I decided to bring them back here. Just like, look at that. That golden sign is from McGee & Co. They're like very, um, Studio McGee's like actual shop. But I have the fairy lights in there and then they're all just paper fans. I'll put the ones that I ordered specifically and they've worked really, really well. I am also lucky that I was able to just attach the lights above and they're on a timer now, but like, it's so beautiful. But this is my favorite time of day where all my lights, I did so many lights this year. So all my garlands are lit. I went ahead and lit my candle. That one will turn on in a couple minutes. It's off, it's time. And then those candles will start up. The tree is on. These tapers are awesome. So I have to get this situation. <laughs> I have to get this cleaned up because this is a mess but I need to get some of these things tucked away and put away. All right, puzzle board, my Vlogmas puzzle. Probably not gonna work on it tonight, but we will be working on it together. Progress updates, all the things, that's all linked down there for you as well. Okay, I am going to get myself a little situated. Steven is walking the dogs and then we'll make dinner. Wait, it's Vlogmas day one. Yay! Yay Vlogmas! Here, you do it with her. Looky. Oh, one. Oh, sort of stuck, there we go. <gasps> Happy Vlogmas, Mabel! It's your first Vlogmas and her first advent calendar. She also loves to eat everything on the couch. 
No. Steven isn't one to get like overly excited yes. about decor. Yes. And it. what did you just say? I said you did a very good job on the railing. He the really loves the banisters, which I mean, hold on, let me turn on the light. How could you not love them? Hold on, let me get one more light. I love how it puddles. And then what I ended up doing is I alternated the drape so it's on this side and then it goes to this side. And then, pardon my carpet, there are pine needles and it looks really dirty but it just needs vacuumed because I have a pine garland that shed a little bit. And then on this side, it does the same exact thing. I wish these were less rose gold and a little bit more coppery. But, I mean, it's still, it still works beautifully. But like this whole, ugh, I love it. All right, Steven is making dinner tonight because I've had holiday parties and all sorts of things. What are we having for dinner, Chef Steven? Peruvian chicken, couscous, and corn. They're gonna wanna know how you prepared the Peruvian chicken. In the uh, Brava, no. 375. How did, what did you season it with? Uh, well, I've been seasoned it. <laughs> so they're like pre-packaged chicken breasts and uh, the Peruvian is one that we really like. It has like a little bit of spice and kick to it. So we are having that couscous. <gasps> Hi, it's your first vlog, miss. You should um, show them these, these books that we got. Oh, Steven got us coffee table books. Yes. To the realization of perfect helplessness. It's a poetry and photo book. It's really good. Okay. And this is Our America. By Ken Burns. He does all the PBS documentaries. Oh my goodness. So I love this photo. These are very good to have on your coffee table. What do they look like with, I, you know I hate a sleeve. Is this just like a, oh yes, that's a good one. Yeah. So. I love like a solid black. So when you come to our house and um, yeah, those are nice. on the couch, you can read poetry and look at photographs. Yes. And then I also have like some styling books. Wow. Also, these are our vitamins that our doggies take. So this is allergy and itch, hip and joint. And that's only for Bubba's. And a multivitamin. Does Mabel take some of um, these? She takes one of the allergy and one of the multi, but Bubba's takes two and two of these. But he doesn't take allergy and itch? Not right now, in the spring and fall he does. Okay. So these these are the vitamins we use for our dogs. Where do you buy them, babe? Uh, they're online. So, if you guys want to know what we do to take care of our little beasties, we use Finn vitamins. And they take their vitamins every day. Don't you? You don't need hip and joint. You're so He's flexible. Sure He's running around like a maniac. All right, I have my candle going. This candle is amazing. Um, it is the old St. Wick one. It was one of Oprah's favorite things this year. But some of my favorite candles are from my dear friend, Christina Brawley. She actually sent me her Hansel and Gretel candles. And then around my house, I have several more. So, love them. Her brand is called Amber, and I will have it linked for you. Amazing candles, very hard to come by, so I'm lucky she's my friend. All right, Stephen is going to make dinner. We did our advent calendars, <gasps> but we didn't do one advent calendar. Oh. Chad's tea. Oh. How pretty the house looks. I think we still have uh, Chad's tea from last year. And her cover. I'm sure we do. Uh, we have more because we had the Halloween one they sent us. Oh, God. Oh, wait. Just don't tear that. You'll ruin that. Cut it nicely. Oh, God, God. I'm already stressed. There's always a saga. All right. What will be the drama this year, you think? Um, Didn't you write, file a complaint with them last year? I did. But then somebody corrected me and said that something was not a, was indeed a, uh, a berry or something. All right, a oh, one, good What? Oh, this must be around this the world. This is around the world. This was their more expensive one. 
Did they have a less expensive one? Yeah. Why didn't we get that one? Have you met me? Mm -hmm. All right, well, we're going to Taiwan first. I was just there last week. No, you were not. Cinnamon oolong. Oh, I like oolong and I love cinnamon. I smell it. It doesn't really smell cinnamony. No, it doesn't. It smells weird. Yeah, it doesn't smell like cinnamon at all. Uh-oh, you might have to file a complaint. Well, I'll try it tomorrow. It might not be cinnamon. I'll try it tomorrow and then we will... Oh, it doesn't... You have to put it back the right way. See? No, you can put it back that way. You know that one's been used. But it doesn't... There's not a picture then. Like there usually oh, is. Oh, well then put it the other way. But don't tear that box. Alright. Well, I'm, I'm looking forward to going around the world. I've never been to Taiwan. How about you close out Vlogmas Day 1 for us? Alright, uh, be kind to others, be kind to yourself, kindness is for everyone, spread it around. Yeah.